Welcome to my Cape Cod vlog. Good morning. Good morning. I'm so off asleep. Walking Brody. <laughs> On my phone, if you guys saw my last vlog, I forgot my vlog camera battery charger. Mm. Hopefully we can fix that today, tomorrow or something. In get a new one. I'm gonna stop by Nirvana. Hopefully all the it's usual. not too busy. Yeah, hopefully not. I feel like it wasn't too bad when I looked yesterday. There's always a crowd of people out front though. Yeah. Like sitting out front, chilling, eating. It's such a nice day. Got our breakfast sandwiches at the market. Yum. Woohoo! I think I've only had this one like once or twice because normally we just get the Nirvana ones, but we're early, so we got some from the market. We'll hit Nirvana on our way back. There's Nirvana right there. We just saw one of you guys drive by and they were like, she was like, Gretchen and Max, mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm a follower. And we were like, oh my God, hey girl. We love meeting you guys. Yeah. I feel like we always end up meeting so many people on the Cape. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him go. Good morning, honey. Are you chewing your dad's sock? Brody, tell them what we did. We finally got a camera battery, yay! And a charger, oh, okay. No more sock. Don't worry, you guys, he loves chess. <laughs> he loves just like throwing it around and playing with it. He would never like swallow it or anything. And I'm always watching him, because socks are your favorite. Socks are your favorite. <laughs> this is so exciting. I finally got, actually just got a whole new camera last night at Best Buy. Long story short. And I'm so happy because I can finally vlog on my camera. So it'll be like nice quality for you guys. But I didn't want you to miss the first couple days we were on Cape Cod. So what you have just seen would have just been all of my iPhone footage. Most of it just sort of like montage style at the beach, food, stuff like that. We've been having best time and I'm so excited to like share more of that with you guys on the camera. I feel like you guys don't even care that much. You're probably just like, oh, you could vlog on your phone. We don't care. But in my mind, like I want it to be nice quality for you guys and for like my memories to look back at. You know, Chase and I, Max's sister, just went to Mary Lou's. So good. This one's like extra yummy today. It's hitting the spot. I always get snickerdoodle with almond milk and it's just so good. They like brew the flavor into the coffee. So it is so delish. showered and ready for the day now after bar it was such a good workout it felt so good to get a little movement in i feel so sleepy today i did not sleep enough last night but i definitely have more energy during the day i notice once i get a morning workout in so it feels so good and right now i just want to give a shout out to the sponsor of today's video thank you so much case Fi, for working with me on this video you guys know they have my most favorite phone cases this one i actually just recently put on my phone don't mind the fact that my phone is actually shattered in the back but this case is 
so protective. Don't be like me, don't be a dummy where, especially if you're getting a new phone, if you're getting the 11, the 12, whatever we're on now, make sure you get a case by case that is so protective before you get your phone. Be ready, be prepared. Not like me, since I shattered this the day I got it, fork out my case by case. So now my case by case protects me from getting glass in my fingers from the back of my phone, but it's obviously so protective against drops. That's why they're so amazing. It's so slim while being so protective. This is actually the impact case, which I need since I am so clumsy and this would be a lot more shattered if I didn't have the impact case. Actually has a two layer protection in the impact case called Chi Tech, which just makes it so durable, but it's so thin. Like you're not compromising the cuteness of your phone case, the style. This one is obviously just customized. It's very simple and clear. I like it. Obviously it would look better probably if the back of your phone was not shattered, but it's kind of a vibe. Like it's kind of fun. Like I kind of like it. It just says GLB, which is like an ode to the old me on YouTube. If you know, you know. So it's so fun. You can do initials, you can do names, you can do monogram. They have so many designs, styles, colors, prints, options for phone cases on their website. Literally, there is something for everyone. If you want Cheetah, the Cheetah is like one of my favorite ones. I actually just ordered another one, you guys. I can't wait for you to see when it comes in the mail. Custom with some photos. Hint, hint. Brody, maybe. Okay, I feel like Max is not going to see this. It's a phone case with like baby Brody photos all over it. I cannot wait for it to come. Max is literally going to freak out. Also, their cases actually have an antimicrobial coating on the outside of their cases. So it just keeps your phone germ-free, killing 99% of bacteria. I'll have case five linked down below if you guys want to check them out. You know, all of my phone cases are case five. It's the only ones I can have on my phone. I need the protective ones, the impact or the ultra impact. The impact will protect your phone for drops up to 6.6 .6 feet. They have military grade drop protection, which I need since clearly drop my phone a lot. I'll have case my link down below and you can still go to casemy.com slash Gretchen. You'll get 15% off your new favorite phone case, especially again if you're getting a new phone. Make sure you get it ahead of time so you're not sorry like I am. And last thing I almost forgot to mention you guys, their impact and ultra impact cases are actually made of 50% recycled material so you can feel great about your phone looking great. And now I'm actually going to show you guys, I ordered bikinis here which only makes sense. I'm on Cape Cod. I'm allowed to be a little bit of a shopaholic with bikinis right since we're going to the beach so much. I literally, I'm looking at them right now, I got the cutest bikinis from Princess Polly. If you guys saw my recent haul video with them, I am just obsessed. One of you actually commented on my Instagram, I was very honored. He said that I was the queen of Princess Polly bikinis which is an honor because I'm obsessed with them. They're just so flattering. I feel so comfortable in them. And I feel like as I've grown up, I've started to just... I don't know, feel uncomfortable in certain type of bikinis or they're like really revealing kind of thing. Anyway, so I just want to show you some bikinis that I'm like really comfortable in, really happy that I spent my money on with my own money and they're not going to break the bank. Like they're not cheap. I'm not going to say that they're like cheap and really, really affordable, but I mean, as far as bikinis goes, you gals out there are probably with me. Bikinis are such a scam, can I say? Because <laughs> they always sell the top and the bottom separate, which makes sense for like sizing, but then I feel like they can get away with like charging so much for each piece but these are really not that bad from Princess Polly so I just want to like show someone I want you to be my friend right now and be like oh my god yes queen I love those since I told you guys my Princess Polly haul how I ordered some bikinis and they're here and I gotta show you okay is this weird right now <laughs> I set you guys up I just want you to be my girlfriends your point of view my best friend Taylor my best friend Louisa you're hyping me up you're giving me your honest opinion I already know if I showed Taylor this she would be like oh my gosh I couldn't do those like the bottoms are too skimpy because she's definitely more like conservative for bikini but Louisa would be like, yes, queen, pop off. I was eyeing this one on Princess Polly for so long because of this color. Look at this, like, periwinkle, perfect blue color. I think it's so stunning. I honestly, too, you know what, Taylor girl, putting words in your mouth, but I'm with you because I usually don't like the string bottoms. Like, I feel like they kind of cut into the side of me and I feel, like, uncomfortable, like they're, like, too skimpy. But these I'm okay with. I feel like I can, like, move them around. I can adjust them so they're not, like, too tight too small you just kind of gotta spread it out a little bit you know is anyone else with me where like these bottoms when they get to like that i'm like oh my gosh i literally feel naked so yeah i think i can adjust it though and feel comfortable i'm just obsessed with this color i think it's so cute also i'm not gonna try this on it's still kind of like wet and sandy from the beach this actually is probably my favorite that i bought it's just like this smocked i feel like this smock detail is so 
flattering and like a floral sort of print it's like a light yellow or the bottoms that go with so cute and then this one it just kind of like jumped out at me also i felt like it was not this color on princess polly it was like a darker green i'm like okay let's try it out but then when it came in person i'm like wow okay was not expecting that i like this way better and it's like this bright turquoisey green just wait till you see <laughs> like are you kidding me why is this one so perfect okay do you see what i mean where i already feel more comfortable having like the thicker bottom i just feel more appropriate like i just feel like i couldn't be around like family with <laughs> like the little tie ones what do you guys think are any of you with me with the bottoms like you're more comfortable with just like the thicker bottom okay this color this bathing suit was just so the underdog like if i'm being completely honest i was like eyeing that blue one for so long and that floral one and i just wanted to spend more i think to get like the free two-day shipping which by the way came so quick so i was like okay we'll just try this one out and this is like probably my favorite one just the color makes me feel like so i don't know bronze the cut i feel like it's so flattering i just feel so i don't know confident in it which is like hard to come by in a bikini sometimes you know like sometimes you put it on and you're like wow i'm uncomfortable also can i just say if we're being really if we're being really honest you guys are so fake i'm mad no i'm not mad i get it but i like you said posted princess poly haul the other day and i feel like people just don't like clothing hauls like they used to that used to be like the number one video i feel like to watch like everyone loved clothing hauls and i get it because i feel like those were the videos i used to watch too and now i mostly watch vlogs like i feel like people just prefer vlogs and so i posted that video and then now i've been posting in all the clothes and all over instagram and it's like oh my gosh where is that bikini from that bodysuit those shorts and i'm like sis if you watch my video you know so yeah you guys should watch my hauls because you actually will see the cutest stuff and like obviously i buy their stuff with my own money like i just think they have the cutest stuff ever when I get to work with them it's like freaking it's a dream come true because I'm always buying stuff with my own money anyway you know what I mean anyway I'm on a rant but I just want to show you my cute new bikinis because it's so cute I literally am going to keep this on right now because I don't even know if we're going to the beach today but I'm manifesting it by keeping my bikini on and then that way maybe we'll go <laughs> I'll get the vibe that I want to go if I'm like running around in the bikini top maybe these are also princess poly shocker i showed these in my haul and they're the only jean shorts i brought here so i've been wearing them like every day but they literally go with everything i've been wearing them to the beach wear them out with like a little bodysuit dress them up dress them down okay see you when we're doing something fun hopefully it's the beach <laughs> outfit of the day still got the bathing suit on still hoping we make it to the beach this god dang train Papa Joe. favorite spot here we i haven't even been inside yet because you just got me the coffee the other day need a little afternoon cold brew did i a little pick me up did you need it no you haven't had it yet no you haven't had it yet no i got it on the way to golf right and you here? got starbucks yeah I haven't even had it. I can't believe it. Oh. <laughs> Save donuts. Yeah. Woohoo. Hi. <laughs> Got our cold brew. Look what I did. Don't we always say I have a hole in my lip? Yes. That's, That's embarrassing. Fold it over. Much better. Cover it up. <laughs> Just leave the whole thing yeah. open. <laughs> oh no. Okay, there we go. later we didn't end up at the beach my manifesting it got, powers it got work. cloudy so cloudy and like cold yeah it, did. it dropped like 10 degrees but, so now no we're going to but it honestly worked out well because i had photos to take you guys will see remember this furry sweater and mm. my favorite lighting is like cloudy overcast even smooth lighting but bright but still bright. Date, I'm very specific about my lighting. Max knows. We tried yesterday, it didn't work. So it worked out today. Right. We're about to get ready to go to dinner soon. And it's gonna be great. Yeah. That's all. Stay tuned. See you at dinner. I wish you could come with us, honey. Having the photo shoot. Here we go. Oh, oh. Give us a pose. <laughs> the crawl flag. Okay, it started raining. Photo shoot cut short. <laughs> Hi. 
just got some cinnamon rolls, as you saw, at Marion's Pie Shop. It was highly recommended. <laughs> Look who was waiting for us. <laughs> We're just doing a little moment in Chatham. I want you guys to try it with me. I've been so excited. I've wanted to get the cinnamon rolls here for so long. Holy, look at how big this thing is. Mm -hmm. Is it like warm? Um, maybe a little. It's probably get oh warm God. in the car. Oh my God, I need like a fork. My hands are gonna be so sticky. Put the AC on. Yeah. Oh, wow. No. Now I know why people come wait for them to open. Holy shit. You want me to rip you off a piece? It's so big. Mm, 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 mm. I like how we go from cinnamon roll to nachos and beer <laughs> and high news. Brody wants nachos, huh? We're in Maui Gold. You see my blue dress from last year. The sparkles, the blue and white. Yeah, we like the ruffles on here. This is the sale. This is fun. Brody's waiting out here. I literally want everything in there, you guys. It's so cute. They have so many cute a goldie shorts and jeans. You guys know my fave. No whining. It's okay. Max just ran into the boy side to look at, I guess, men's side. No, honey. Brody's so sad. It's okay, he'll come right back. Come on. Hello, hello. <laughs> Are you looking at him? Oh, Brody. It's because he can see him right there. Did you miss him? What? what? Oh, yeah. <laughs> back inside. After the day, we got new bodysuit. Old, pretty old from Aritzia. Just like simple nude tan. My favorite white jeans from Revolve. I will link if they're in stock. Well, I can link them either way, but they're sold out a lot because they're so cute. Literally fit perfect. The raw wide leg hem. Get the music so loud. I'm trying on jean shorts. You couldn't tell. A goldie. Shocker. Okay, I love these. These are the D shorts. D-E-E. -E. I remember I tried them last summer and I couldn't get the sizing right or I didn't like. I got them in like black or white and I don't know. I couldn't like figure out. They weren't working. But these are so cute. I love the color, the distress thing. They're a little longer. I think they're so nice. We're wearing these out of here since it's so hot. I'm getting so hot in my white jeans. Now I can wear shorts. We have had the funnest time here, huh? There's so many people. It's so nice out. Brody's being so social. I he gave was them feeling a, little... a bit left out while you I girls know, were, shopping. were shopping. He was upset. I told them about my outfit, my new shorts, and I think we're headed back. Let's Hello. end off this Kate vlog oh, here. Are we doing two? Because I think I'm going to do a weekend. It's the weekend, baby. Because it's Friday afternoon. Remember that video? Anyway, I thought I'd end this off here. That was so fun in Chatham. Also realizing I wanted, remember I wanted to give them a little out for the day last night at dinner? Oh, yeah. But then I was really just showing the food. I wasn't really talking and Max was informing me that you're not really supposed to be on your phone or camera at Hyannis Port. But I, an exception I was a little bit you. for you guys. Luckily Chase had to capture content too on her phone. So we were like doing it together. Yeah, no, it, it's not as strict as... That sounds. Was. Oh, yeah. or and that. so now it's like Both. more chill. Yeah. Anyway, I can insert a photo right here because we took a bunch of photos in my pink dress. I didn't like twirl around in it. I wanted to, I forgot. But yeah, it was just love shack fancy. I've been waiting for the right time to whip it out. And last night was a perfect time, don't you think? It was a perfect moment. I also don't think I even said where we went to dinner. And I don't know how to say it, but it's a golf club. And Max's grandpa is a member and he golfs there every single day. And they have the nicest restaurant. So it was so nice there. It was like the most beautiful views which you guys could probably see but love you guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in my next cake vlog starting in probably an hour bye now yeah. bye now <laughs>